Hey everyone, I'm Major Batman. I'm here today to show you how to add the Polygon Kids face plates onto adults. And I'll include the link in the description. So you now get to the link to, in the description and scroll down. These are all free assets that you can use in your projects. But we're interested in the Polygon Adults face plates map pack. Once you have it downloaded, you'll want to open it up and you'll see that there's two different face plates. There's one for the adult male and one for the adult female. So what we're going to do is we're going to unpack both of those and just drag them into our project. All right, now that they're imported, I have open in, in front of us the Battle Royale pack from Cinti Studios. I have a male and a female. So what we're going to do is we're going to take the male and we're going to open it up. You can do this by clicking Alt and the little arrow and navigate to the head. From the head, we're just going to drag the adult male faceplate onto the head. And by default, it comes with the smile. Not too bad. And we're going to repeat the same for the female. So open hers up and drag the female adult plate onto the head bone. Again, now they both have a smile. Uh, by default, the Polygon Kids has both the face and the crying. And in order to change that, you just click on the faceplate and you drag over the material. And now she is crying. And we can do the same for, for the man. Clicking on the faceplate and make him also crying as well. On the males, it's a little lower. And so this can be fixed by slightly adjusting the position of the faceplate. Or perhaps even the scale. So let's maybe change the scale to... It's not a perfect match with these face plates and all the different textures, but it allows you to create your own if you want to. And that is how to add the face plates onto the adult models using the Polygon Kids asset and the free adult face pack from the Cinti store. Thank you for watching.